Hundreds of basements are filled with floodwaters tonight in Livonia because of today's drenching rains. Action News reporter Cheryl Choden saw the damage firsthand. The water is thigh high in Vince Nalen's Livonia basement tonight, a finished and furnished basement. His backyard is flooded as well. I was shocked. I got a call from the neighbor, said that it was happening to him, and you know, I came home right away. And it's, uh, I'd say it's about a good two and a half, three feet in the basement. The basement next door is just as bad. Right now, a box of diapers fell apart from the flood. The pool table, TV, computer, couch, washer, dryer, all of it's underwater. Oh, I was devastated. There's so much money and time in our basement, my wedding dress, uh, just, ev I mean, everything. Our baby, we just had a newborn baby, all of her stuff that we got from the shower ruined, not to mention um, just uh, everything. We, everything we've lost. It just takes the breath away from you. I mean, just to see all that just gone to waste and just wonder how that could ever be back to what, the where it once was. Sarah and Nick Lewandowski and almost every one of their neighbors on Linden are working to try to pump out. But not much has changed since noon. In fact, Sarah says at their house, the water got deeper. We measured it at 22 inches. The mayor tells us tonight they've had 300 calls about flooded basements. 75%, he says, are filled with rainwater. The other 25% are filled with water from the sewers. He says the ground is just so saturated. And the storm drains couldn't handle the downpour today, so it backed up into the basements. And all of a sudden, just to have something like this happen, it just, just, it's just unexpected, and you just, you just don't know how to react. This is what you're hearing all up and down Linden Street tonight. People are trying to pump out of their basements. You can see the water here. Everybody is exhausted and disappointed. The mayor says they will do everything they can to try to help the people soak up, pump out. They'll try to pick up trash if they can. He said they will not be able to compensate the homeowners unless the drains were not maintained. He said they'll check all of that out tomorrow. Reporting live in Livonia, I'm Cheryl Choden, Channel 7 Action News.